Seth Money right. Brown, Eric right. said, Junior. Right. Money Brown, he get a lot of money, that's why I call him Money Brown. <laughs> <laughs> What's good, Money Brown TV? What up, what up? Yeah. I want to give a shout out to Money Brown TV. Thank you so much for everything. Hey, it's Brian Garcia here. Shout out to Money Brown TV. And, uh, keep punching, you, Yo, 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 what's going on out the fight world? This your boy Money back with another one, fam. And this one here is on two big dogs in this fight game. We got the legendary Canelo Alvarez, the hottest fight on the planet, the four division world champion, the undisputed super middleweight world champion, ready to go face the best to become the greatest Mexican fighter of all time and one of the greatest to ever lace him up. And then we have Arthur Betterbeeb, the unified light heavyweight world champion who just destroyed Marcus Brown to retain both of his world title, undefeated, one killer in the game. But Canelo Alvarez want to let Better Be know. I'm coming for you, my friend. Yeah, at the Better Be. Yeah, I'm coming. Keep my belts warm. My belts. So, Canelo Alvarez, we all know, on his way to 190, 195, cruise away to become a five division world champion, making history, right? Making more history after he just created history after becoming the first. Undisputed super middleweight world champion, the first Mexican in the four belt era to be undisputed. You feel me? Canelo want to do the biggest and the best things in boxing, bro, to continue his legacy to become the greatest Mexican fighter of all time. And he's doing that. If he go up there, he beat McAboo, he become a five division world champion. But then he set his eyes on the light heavyweight division. And he's coming. He's coming. And he's going to show everybody that the performance last night from Better Be ain't enough. It ain't enough to stop this king. From running the game. Or the better be. What can I say about this dude man. Strong as an ox. I say strong as an ox. You understand me. This man is so fucking strong. It's redundant. You know. He went out there last night. Fought a hell of a fight. Uh, Marcus Brown. I gave Marcus Brown the first two rounds. After that it was all better be. Better be went out there. And he just showed his dominance. Right. He just pressured. 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 Brought the mental toughness. Broke Marcus Brown down and eventually beat his ass into submission. He made that man quit. He made that man take a knee, made him quit, just like he retired Alexander Gusick. So, Arthur better be after the fight, said he's ready for anybody. To be the best, you have to beat the best. To be the best, you have to beat the best. But we all know Arthur better be want Canelo Alvarez. Everybody wants Canelo Alvarez. You feel me? He said that would be a fight that he would love to have. He's the number one fighter in the world, and I want to prove that I can defeat him. Canelo, try to make the Arthur Better B fight happen. This is what people don't know. For all you cats out there that like to hate on Canelo Alvarez, he tried to make the Arthur Better B fight happen, but it just wasn't the right time in Arthur Better B team. They declined the fight. But Canelo Alvarez will return to the light heavyweight division. And like I said, he got his eyes set on the unified champion, Arthur Better B. Now, People look at my guy Canelo, they say he's too small for Arthur Betterbeeb. They say Arthur Betterbeeb is too strong. They feel like Canelo can't take his power, right? But we heard that story before, right? We seen that book. We, 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 we read that chapter with Triple G and what happened to Triple G. I say what happened to Triple G. Canelo beat him twice. That's right. Canelo beat him twice, period. So he's going to go to 175. And repeat the same thing he did at 160 and at 168. And that's defeat this man right here and Arthur Better Be. That's right. Defeat this unified champion and Arthur Better Be. Now, no one said it's going to be easy. Nobody said it's going to be easy. But Canelo don't want an easy task. He want the best of the best. You feel me? This is the number one light heavyweight fighter at the division. And that's what Canelo do. He, he beats nothing but... The number one fighters at the division. Period. Now, what the better be? But strong as an ox, like I tell y'all. Look at him with his damn sludge hammer and his turn. Y'all don't understand how much strength it takes to continue to do this. You feel me? This work on muscles. This work on the muscles. You dig? So, what the better be? is a strong challenge. He's a strong man. So, Canelo got his work cut out for him. You feel me? Better be ain't fit to lay down. He can take a shot. He can give a shot. Right? But he ain't never seen nothing like Canelo Alvarez, man. He ain't never seen nothing like that redhead Mexican. They can do it all. Canelo can jab. Canelo can counterpunch. Canelo can throw combinations. Canelo can go to the body. Canelo got defense. Canelo can use angles. Canelo can fight off the back foot. 
Canelo can fight off the ropes, right? And not only that, he got a fucking chin. Canelo has a chin. Something that a lot of these fighters don't got. You dig? Shouts out to my brother Greg Hackett. How are y'all getting into these high caliber fights and your chin ain't insured? You did. That's a fact. Canelo chin is insured, baby. Two times over. He pay his insurance chin bill. You dig? He pay his insurance chin bill. That's going over a lot of y'all heads, man. But like I say, what the better be, he's going to bring it, man. He's going to try to bring it inside the ring. He's going to try to bring that mental pressure that's not going to affect Canelo Alvarez. But Canelo will meet him. He's too slow. He's too slow, bro. But he will get some rounds in. He will get some rounds in. Could he go to decision? Yes, he can. Could Canelo stop this man? Yes, he can. You feel me? And I'm going to tell y'all how. You don't have to knock somebody out to stop him. That's for once. Canelo can break this man down to the body. Canelo can bust this man face up. And Canelo can put so much hurt on him to where the corner and the referee will have to stop the fight. Because somebody like Arthur better be, who's going to be right there for you. He's going to come forward. He's going to come forward. And he's going to try to, um, you know, unleash his, 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 you know, his arsenal on Canelo Alvarez by going downstairs, coming upstairs, trying to break his body down. But like I say, Canelo ain't no stupid, um, you know, little fighter that's just going to stand there and let you push him to the ropes and keep him on the ropes and all that. No, 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 no. Canelo is no Marcus Brown, homie. Canelo is no Olazan Agusif. You feel me? Canelo has experience. And I tell y'all, man, if this fight get made, and I believe it will, Canelo Alvarez is going to look damn good in this fight. He's going to look damn good in this fight. Now, like I say, he's going to take some hard shots. My guy is going to take some hard shots. But the better be is no slouch. He's no slouch by any means. Don't, don't get this shit fucked up. Don't get it twisted like I'm saying. Oh, man, just got Canelo like he's just a god. No, he's going to take some shots. But I know Canelo's skill set is way above this man. I know Canelo's level is above this man. I know Canelo's drive is above this man. You understand what I'm saying? I can see this fight playing out in my head already. I know what shots Canelo go throw. I know what Canelo's going to do to this man, bro. I know what he's going to do. And the body shots of Canelo Alvarez, they're just going to be so vicious. They're going to be so vicious. You feel me? Arthur better be, you can't get away from Canelo body shots. And he will throw combination shots downstairs. He will. Marcus Brown did some combination punching downstairs, and it froze better be in a few of those rounds. Canelo Alvarez won't let up. He won't let up. He will not let up. And he damn sure ain't go quit. He damn sure ain't go quit. Now, what Arthur better be, man, like I say, he's going to have to have a perfect game plan because Canelo Alvarez is different than anything he's saying. He's going to try to go in there. He's going to try to walk him down, stalk him down, use his power, his brute strength. His jab is not um, that long like that, but he do got a, a cool jab to try to get in, things of that nature. And one thing he know how to do, he know how to cut off the ring. I will say better be know how to cut off the ring, but it's mental pressure. It's his number one um, weapon that he used to break down his opponents. Mental pressure, mental pressure. And what I always tell my people out there, bro, I think Canelo has the strongest mental in boxing, the strongest. So once Canelo take that away from Arthur Better B, and Arthur Better B, you see that, God damn, this shit ain't working with me coming forward and my mental pressure because Canelo doing what? Meet me halfway. Because Canelo doing what? Meet me halfway. Or Canelo doing what? Tying me up and turning me. And I didn't believe that this motherfucker was this strong. Canelo Alvarez is a strong man, homie. He's strong as well. Now, don't get me wrong. I know at the, at the better be is, you know, um, physically strong. He's a Russian. We see the, the the workouts he do. But Canelo Alvarez is strong as well, bro. Kovalev was strong. Triple G was strong. You dig what I'm saying? They were strong. And we're seeing what Canelo did with them. We're seeing what he did with them. And I think once Canelo started touching that chin on better be and better be see that, God damn, this dude has a chin and my mental pressure is not working. What's my game plan? Right? What is my plan B? What do I go to? Because this motherfucker Canelo got five, six girls, baby. He got five, six girls. You understand? But Canelo Alvarez is coming for all the better beef, everybody. He is. He tried to make this fight happen before. Canelo told people already, I'm not afraid of him. That's the fight I want. I want the challenges. I want the challenges. You feel me? And after that performance, all the better beef put on with Marcus Brown, that was a hell of a performance to retain his titles. 
But I seen the holes in Arthur Better Beep. I seen him. I been seen him. But now I really see him, bro. And Canelo is only getting better, everybody. He told y'all the best is yet to come, baby. He told y'all the best is yet to come. And this man is on his radar. This man is on Canelo Alvarez's radar. Canelo will go to the Cruiserweight division. He will become a five-division world champion, the WBC Cruiserweight world champion, right? But we're going to let it be one fight at a time. I'm not going to look past Macaboo like all these other dudes doing, being haters. But assuming Canelo get past that guy and become a five-division world champion, he will come to 175. I repeat, he will come to 175. He will get his feet wet, and what the better be will be his next victim. He will be his next victim. And I see Canelo Alvarez being victorious, man. It's just his era. He's on point. He's standing in the gym. He's learning new things. He's not afraid of anything. No man, right? Nobody put fear in Canelo heart. And when Better Be step in that ring with Canelo Alvarez, it ain't that Canelo better be ready. It's what the Better Be better be ready. I'm going to repeat. It's not that Canelo better be ready. I said what the Better Be better be ready. And those are facts. To all y'all cats out there that's taking this to guy to beat Canelo Alvarez, to everybody that's out there praising Arthur Better Beep now, I'm talking about he's a cock strong dude. He gonna do this to Canelo. Canelo gonna be afraid to fight him. We gonna see him. He gonna go to 175. He gonna face the weakest link, this, that, and the third. When he get into the ring with this man, when he take this man head off, when he snatch those two titles, and then he finish his reign to become undisputed at the light heavyweight division, y'all better give him his just due. Y'all better give him his just due. And I'm tired of telling cats to get Canelo Alvarez and just do because we already know once he beat one dude, it's going to be something else. So at this point, I just want Canelo to keep proving y'all bums wrong and show y'all that he can't be fucked with in his boxing game. The dude is on another level. And he will show when he get better beep in the ring. I promise you that. I promise you. Shouts out to Arthur Better Beeb. Congratulations on the big win over Marcus Brown. You retain your titles. I really enjoyed the fight. But your day's a number, my friend. Shouts out to the King Canelo Alvarez. Go up to Cruiserweight. Destroy that man. Become an undisputed champion at the light heavyweight division. And show these boys why you're the greatest Mexican fighter of all time. And one of the greatest to ever lace him up. Shouts out to my guy. Until then, it's your boy Money. It's the NSBC moving. Ain't nobody safe in these streets. Hit them thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel. If you want to donate, OG Money on Cash App. Trey Hampton 52 at gmail.com on PayPal. If not, just tell a friend. Tell a friend. Hit the subscribe button. Like, comment, share the videos. And y'all know how your boy get down, man. Big dog status, family.